I'd be duplicitous to, to specifically name it, but I'm not necessarily opposed to it either. I think it's already been covered, and I certainly recognize Mr. Fry, I need you to suspend your comments a minute. I need the House stand at ease. Watch out, Jamie. It is with a heavy heart that all of us watched as one of our members, Mr. Bales, who's been here for 20 years, he came in with you and I, as he went out with EMS, uh, he was awake and alert, um, and as the House applauded his absence, he, as you know and as you noted yesterday, was involved in a car accident he told me this morning that he flipped his car three times, but he came back to the State House last night to check in. He wants the people in his district to know that he does not want to miss a day. He loves being up and he loves doing the work of the people of South Carolina. And as such, I know that it pained him more than anything else to, be, to have to leave here while we were continuing to work, even though he left on a stretcher. Uh, I stand with his seatmate, Coach Anthony. Uh, as we would ask that, Mr. Speaker, and I know these are your plans, first of all, that we would thank Dr. Ridgway and the Doctor of the Day and all those. <laughs> and of course, the Sergeant at Arms staff and everybody. If I could have every member stand in a moment of silent prayer, as um, Mr. Rutherford said, Mr. Rutherford, Mr. Hayes, and Mr. Bales and I came in together. Um, uh, we have a tremendous bond, so what I saw shook me up substantially, as I know it did Mr. Rutherford. I want to thank everybody who participated in Dr. Bales' care. Um, um, Dr. Ridgway, you are God's end. We, we appreciate you in this house. Dr. Coleman Buckhouse, also our doctor today, assisted. We never know when we need them, but when we do, we thank God they're there. But thank you all, everyone, who assisted with um, Dr. Bales. Um, Mr. Rutherford, I think that's a good plan, but I'd like to stand just in a moment of silent prayer for my good friend, our good friend, our colleague, Mr. Jim Bales. Amen. 